what's up guys? All right, we're back. We are going to take two with the most durable plane in the world. And we're gonna make it do 100 miles an hour. And right now we're just getting it tuned. I see I got my deep battery hole. I might go a little wider to run a larger pack because the biggest I can fit in here is a uh, 4S and I want to try a 5S and 6S in here. I know the motor will take a 5S. I think 6S would be pushing it a bit. I'm checking GPS weights. I've got these three GPSs here. Um, the GNS Performance by Sky RC. I got the GPS Logger V2. And then I got the good old faithful <laughs> Dynamite GPS. So we're going to check the weight, see where they're at. So 82.8 grams, that's a heavy one. Let's see what this bad boy weighs. 81 grams, so that's last place there. That's middle place there. And let's see what the Sky RC is. 69 grams, so this is the winner. That's the one we're gonna put in. Um, I might have to even cut a slot for it because I'm gonna be doing a lot of speed tests with this aircraft. And, you know, we really want it to, uh, you know, the CG to be correct. The CG is the center of gravity. So we want that to be correct here. So maybe that's what I'll do. I'll Velcro it there, test it out, see what we get. Um, check some speeds with this little tiny 400 turn, uh, 400. I think it's a 415. Once again, we're using the 1300 milliamp 90C. You can see it there. Uh, 4S. So we we pretty much done it. We built this bulletproof plane. We're going to take it out, test fly it, get it trimmed in. It's too cold to do everything at once. Uh, make it a two-trip thing. We'll get it out, get it flying, show you some flight footage. From there, what we'll do is I'll start putting on the cameras on the aircraft. Remember, I want to get this bad boy to 100 miles an hour, and I want to hit a wall full blast and pick it up, throw it, and fly it again. So last peek at it, here it is. edition on this one this this is cheap this is all everything i've already owned i've had this motor for years and years and years i've got um, just the custom the materials outside of electronics in this well under 100 bucks so we'll call this a hundred dollar 100 mile per hour bulletproof trainer slash plane i guess is what we'll call it so here we go guys let's get out there let's have some fun all right, I've decided I'm gonna start this bad boy right up in the car. There's a few people out there. I'm letting them walk their dog by. I got my leash on, I got my transmitter here. Fire up the DX9 real quick. Put my throttle hold on so nothing takes off in the, air, in the car here. We're running a three cell with a seven by six right now. I didn't tape down my wires, unfortunately, today. All right, so no throttle. We should get a little throttle here. We got a little throttle. Surface check up, down, left, right. Now that's minimum throw. You drop down into your second flight mode where you don't get as much, and then your first one when you're going real fast. But I'm gonna use the first one for my first launch throttle hold on so I don't chop my face off so it's not a big deal. Smaller airfoil. We here guys it where it's cold just above freezing. Today it is a little warmer than what it was yesterday. <laughs> Alright there. Um, I have to figure out where the brake is and uh, uh, plug it in or figure out the programming protocol for it Let's just fly it. I think it'll be fine. Let's just let's just send it Beautiful. Oh, yeah, it's got way better climb today folks 
landing guys but yeah we sent the trail of smoke uh, we'll park this for now is that a drone oh i see what it is guys we got that white smoke it's kaput luckily we got two or three more motors to play with i believe that mega motors those two previous motors are gonna work good it was a speed controller thing i'm pretty sure but we're gonna find out in the next episode 